my name is Sam Pam the Ravioli Man, and I'm gonna show you how to be a pro painter like me, because obviously, just by my voice and looks, I am a professional. Alright, so, first, what you gotta start out with, you know, get your pen, get your pen or whatever you use, you know, go up here, go to file, you know, you know, get your new layer here, it doesn't matter what size, you know, and then what you gotta do now is that, you know, you get your line works on here, you know, line work layer, that it's beautiful, you know, get your, get your line works on here, you know. Doesn't matter what color, you know, you get your purples in there, you know, they just, they look beautiful. And, you know, if you, if you mess up a little bit, erase that, yeah, just a little bit, you know, because you don't want to, you don't want to, yeah, you don't want any of that showing. So, you know, I suggest using, um, hash marks, because, you know, hashtag no filter, bruh, yeah, that's what's up, okay. Once you're done with your line work layer, add a new layer, because all the layers, are important to the world, you know, about, um, 11 teen is just fine. Alright, so what you gotta do now, above this layer of epicness, get your whatever color and just start, you know, spreading all that, whatever that word means, you know, get your greens in there, you know, your cool colors, you know, and if you need to, get the, the, the thing to stand out, you know, get some, get some, uh, you know, red, you know, your primaries in there, primary colors are key, they make the world what it is, you know, now, and also, I suggest listening to music, so, you know, listen to something that isn't going to, you know, let your brains out, oh, yo, you know what, I'm going to get something for you, let me use my mouse, get out of here, you pen, and, you know, I suggest you listen to something calming, yeah! Very nice piece! Okay, and I suggest you blend it a little bit. So, it's obvious what all of the guys do. They always use the blur tool. You know, best tool in the world. I mean, really. Or, you could be even more swag like me and use the brush tool. You know, get your, get your blues. You know, it just mixes the entire thing up, you know. Just gets everything to be what it is. It gets everything to make the world a better place. And what life is and what the banana splits um, did to the monkey man in space reality. You know, get some, get some highlights in there, you know. Highlights are key. You know, you know, you don't want this thing to look boring, do you? You know what I mean? Yeah, you know. Oh, this is actually starting to look very good right now. So, I'm just going to, you know, do some highlights. Make it thing look more vibrant. And, um, you know, get to my new layer here. Because, you know, layers are always important. Get your different type of, you know, luminosity. Luminati confirmed, bruh. Luminati. Yeah. That's right. Get that in there. You know, get your blur tool again. Make it look shiny. Yes. You know, this thing is just so beautiful. So, what you gotta do now, since your masterpiece is now finished, what you gotta do is, um, just make your final details, you know. Make it look nice. Beautiful. There we go. That's right. Just, you know, put something that'll catch the eye. You know? And then what you gotta do afterwards, you know, you gotta, you gotta sign your name here. You know, you gotta sign your name so people don't hijack your photos, you know. Or, if you want to get real creative, you know, you can go again. You can go again, you know. And then you can just, you can just, um, you know. I'm pretty sure that's how you spell my name. You know, just put some things that people know of, you know. Something that'll just catch the eye. Beautiful!
That's a beautiful equation right there. You know, just make everything noticeable. You know. Yeah, that's all. That's all you gotta do right there. Yeah, you see? Now, afterwards, what you gotta do, you know, after you're done citing your thing there, you know, save the thing. You know, just call it something, um, genius. Yeah. You know, just get that done. You know. And then once you're done with all that, once you're done with all that, you got there, you know, get that out of here. And you know, if people say it looks weird, just say you were inspired by Starry Night. Van Gogh right there. So yeah, that's all you gotta do. And then once you're done with that, all you gotta do is, you know, go to Deviant Art. Just go to Deviant Art. Oh, I got six notes for cushions there. Probably just some some things, you know, go over here, you know, undo your thing. And you know what you gotta do, you gotta, you gotta submit your work here. You gotta submit your work. And then, you know, right before you do, you know, put your caption there, and then you go ahead, click your beautiful submit button, and you will see your work. How did it get mirrored? I have no idea, but, you know, sooner or later, you will get your views that you deserve. So, yes, that was my tutorial. Hope y'all enjoy it. Adios, amigos. Goodbye. Later, alligators. Ooh.